Hey, what's up everyone? Danny Lightning back with another CSR2 video. So I finally think I figured out how to drive the Mustang Crowbar Jet in live racing. Now, for some reason, I cannot get a good start on this car in live for some reason. I'm always running like two or three tenths of a second slower than I should be. This is the only car I seem to have this problem on. And it seems like for some reason this car lags when I go into live racing and... I've kind of been playing with it, you know, I didn't really do much with it for quite a while because I, was, I was annoyed and frustrated, but I just got to launch differently. So basically the launch, I find if I let go of the gas pretty much like a split second before you hit number one on the countdown, that gives me the good start. Usually it's somewhere right like halfway in between number one and number two when I let go, but... In a live racing, it's like a split second before number one, I can let go of the gas, and then I get a 7.0 or faster almost every time. So let's try and race this guy. He's got this win-lose in his name. I'm just going to do a couple quick swaps with somebody. So the first race, I'm going to try and get a good start. Then I'm going to let somebody win, then try and get a good start. That is if we can get into the live race. So... It appears that today the game is being lame. All right, so the countdown has ended. I want to find somebody else. Let's try and race this guy here. He's got a swap symbol in his name. I don't know what happened. He just disappeared. This guy wants to race. We'll go ahead and do it. This guy may not want to swap, but we'll see what happens. All right, so... Alright, three, two, let go, let's go, second in nitrous, and I should run a 7.0 or maybe even a 6.9 after that run, okay? So I let go of the gas just a teeny tiny bit before number one, there I got 6.964, so for some reason in showdown and live racing, I have to launch this car slightly different. That's really all there is to it. So he wants a rematch. I'm guessing this guy does want to swap. So I'm going to let him win this time. Alright. Three, two, let go. And I actually messed, messed up my start on that one. So now I'm going to challenge him back. And as long as he wants to swap, he'll take the challenge. I'm guessing it does. Most people in this lobby swap for some reason. Well, maybe not. Maybe he just wanted a rematch. But I know it's a lot of people, whether they have the swap swap thing in their name, actually swap in the really fast lobbies. Alright. And nobody, nobody, nobody. That car is probably going to beat the crap out of me because I see he's got all the elite custom stuff. That's the new fastest car in the game if you can add all the Elite Custom parts to it. It runs like a 6.903 or something crazy like that. Something like that. I don't remember the exact number, but 6.912. Something along those lines. Yeah, he got me. Let's see what he ran and let's see what I ran. All right, there I got a 7.2, so my start was bad. He got a 6.976. We'll try this again. I let go of the gas just a little too soon that time, I believe. So you got to time your start just right. Live racing is weird with this car. Three, two, let go. There we go, perfect. Now, who's going to win? I think I got it. Did I get it? Yes, I did. I got a 977 and he got a 7.0. So he wasn't trying to swap, I don't think. Yeah, he's not challenging me back. So he didn't want to swap. Alright, let's move on to the next guy. Yeah, they've even, they've even got 
purple stars on those, so. I wonder how much it costs people to max those things out already, because, I don't know, I don't think anybody would be able to max one of these out without spending real money on it. I could be wrong, though. I could be very wrong. Maybe people that are doing amazing in all of the showdowns. Because showdowns is where you earn all the tokens for these things. I can't believe there's not more people in here with the swap thing. I'm going to go out and go to a different lobby. Hopefully I get into a different lobby. Usually it keeps putting you back into the same lobby over and over. As long, but if, you, if you're in a long, lobby long enough and you leave then it will let you change, but if I were to go out and then back in, I would go right back into this one. Ah, oh, man, I wanted to race the Supra, but that's the same guy. He's probably swapping with himself or something. Let's go ahead and race Candy here. Candy win-lose iOS. So that's really all there is to it, is just let go of that gas, at least for me. I don't know. At least for me, that's what's working. Three, two, let go. I think I let go too early that time. I let go just a tad too soon. I still won, though. You know what? On the next one, we're going to let go exactly at number one and see what happens. Let's try to let go on number one instead of just before. Maybe that'll work. I don't know. I gotta let this guy win, though. He's got the swap thing, and I got the first race, so it's his turn to win. Three, two, one, go. So I'm just gonna stay in second gear. Now we'll challenge him to the next race. I'm pretty sure if I let go of the gas at number one, though, I don't run a good time either. So it's the, the trick to this is getting the exact perfect launch. That's really the deal with getting a good time on this car. Three, two, one, go. There we go. I think I let go exactly at number one. As close as possible. And I won. 7.115. So that's still a pretty good run. It's not a 7.0 or a 6.9, but it's still a good run. And he's not going to challenge me back, huh? Maybe he's out of gas or something. So I got three things of gas left. There he is. It's his turn to win if he takes the challenge. Sometimes the game just disconnects you in live racing for no reason, but... Alright. Three, two, one, go. That was perfect. Alright, that would have been perfect. Except for I'm riding it out in second gear to let him win. I can just tell by what the uh, I can just tell by what the the needle does if I got a good start or not. So the second I launch, I, I already know whether or not my start was good, just by watching the needle. Three, two, one, go! And that wasn't quite it, but that was very close. So I probably got a seven point one on this run. Which is still really good. I really want to see 7.0s or faster. But that wasn't bad. That was not bad. Better than a 7.2 something. But yeah, it's very hard to get a really good start on this guy. Alright, it's his turn to win. 
There it is. Perfect. And of course, I gotta let him win. That would have been a seven. That would have been a six point nine run. All right. If I hadn't had, didn't have to let that guy win, that would have been a six point nine. All right. One more thing of gas. After that, I'm probably just gonna go ahead and. You know what? I'm gonna refill my gas because this is a wild card. I need to do a couple more, another couple tanks of gas. So. I might as well just do the whole thing. I'll record a couple more. Ah, slow. Too slow. I let go of the gas just a little bit too late that time. It really is a pain. So let's try and hurry up and refill this gas so I can still challenge him back. Yes, back. Crap. He left already. Okay. Wait, well, you no, know, it was it was it was his turn to challenge me. So let me see if I can find him again. I won that last race, so it's his turn to win. If he's still here, it looks like he's gone, maybe. He might not be here anymore. Do you guys see anybody by the name of Candy? Because I do not. Yeah, I believe he's gone, so let's try and race this guy. To it muscle, alright? It arm or it muscle or something. Here we go. Three, two, let go. Ah, that was a little bit of a crappy start. Look, he just blew by me. He got a perfect start and I did not. Yep, he did much better. I let go of the gas just a little too late on that one. Let's see. He accepted my challenge. I'm not really expecting him to let me win, but he might. Let's see what happens. Man, I messed it up again. This car isn't really that easy to drive. He got a 7.0 that time, and I got a 7.1. I'm still happy with the 7.1 just because this car is such a pain in the butt, but I said butt butt. I already know that. Don't make fun of me. I don't want to, I know someone's going to be on the comments saying butt butt. <laughs> I can, I can hear it now. He said butt butt. Alright, let's race this guy. Maybe that's why I should name the video butt butt. Alright. Three, two, one, go. Perfect. See that? We just got a 6.9 right there. Whoa, that guy was fast. I win. 6.956. It's all about the timing of when you let go of the gas. That's all there is to it on getting a good launch on this car. Alright, so now it's his turn to win. So I'm going to have to just ride it out in second gear. That was it. That was it. Pretty sure. That might have been a 7.0 run instead of a 6.9, but that was a very, very good start. Yesterday, I don't think I really live raced yesterday. I, I, I think I was in a really bad mood, and I think the game was being a pain in the butt. I was like, man, I'm sick of this crap. I think I took the day off from live racing yesterday. Three, two, let go. That wasn't bad. That was probably a 7.0 run. I don't think that was a 6.9. Hey, dude, it was my turn. I think. Wasn't it? I can't re-challenge him. He must have... Uh... Wait, he, he... Did that guy or didn't that guy not finish the cro cross the finish line before me because... I won that race, but he flew across the finish line. I don't get it. 
telling you, live racing is all kinds of lag lately. So I'm just going to ride it out in second gear. I think that's the first time the opponents crossed the finish line first and I've been awarded the win. I've never, never really, I've never seen that before. Oh man, what happened? He might be out of gas. Maybe the game disconnected us, but. Okay, so let's go ahead and look through. I wish this car wasn't so hard to drive because I was all kinds of excited to get it. He might even be out of gas because he's still there. Alright, this guy's got a swap thing in his name, so we'll run a couple races with this guy. I don't know if I like the paint jobs that I see on most of these McLaren F1s. That was a bad start. He's going to win. Alright, that time I let go of the gas just a little bit too late. Maybe a little too soon. I don't know. I didn't let go of it. Purple rims. Look at that. Some pretty interesting stuff going on with these Legends cars and their colors. Alright. Three, two, one, go. Another bad start, man. I, I have such a hard time getting good starts on this thing. See, the thing is, most of the time when I go into these fast lobbies, I just swap with people anyways. So I guess it really doesn't matter if you get a good start or not. But it drives me crazy that this car is such a pain in the butt to drive for live racing. Alright. So I believe it's his turn to win, I think. Is it my turn to win? I don't know. I, I, I totally forgot. Alright. I'm pretty sure it was his turn. And that's pretty much it, huh? He disappeared, so let's go back to the lobby. I still need to win five more races in order to get my uh, 15 silver keys, so I'll fill, my, I'll fill my tank one more time. Hopefully I can find somebody who wants to swap for the entire tank of gas. I think I'm going to leave the lobby and go back. It's kind of weird. There, there doesn't seem to be as many people in the lobbies as there should be recently. Alright. Here we go. Mo Ghost and Mojo something there. Shaggy, no, nope. I was about to challenge Shaggy, but his little his little challenge notification disappeared. Alright. Super Bert. Super Bert. That's kind of a cool name. Why do I think that's a cool name? I'm not exactly sure. Three, two, one, go. That was a pretty good one. I think that's a seven point. That was a seven point zero run. Got him. That was a seven point zero run. Sure was. I'm getting good at judging how fast the car went just by watching the RPMs on my launch. Alright, so now it's his turn to win. I get that right almost every time, don't I? Three, two, one, go. That was a really, really good run, or would have been. Alright, I gotta let him win. Now it's my turn. Oh man, I don't know if I really like this car to tell you the truth. I would rather drive my Copa Camaro or my uh, Bugatti Cento, a Cento de Achi. Someone's going to complain about the way I said that. So I don't know. 
Oh crap, I really screwed that start up. But I guess it wasn't that bad, was it? I think that was a 7.0 run. Check it out, 7.0. I guess I didn't I didn't mess it up as bad as I thought. All right, so it's this guy's turn to win. Swapping is nice because it's easy. You guys know how the disconnect, the connection errors, and the race void and crap goes on all day long. It's nice just to be able to connect to somebody and just run a bunch of races out with them until you're out of gas. So much easier once you find someone you can connect to. Most of the time, you can just for the next hour, you you know, if you guys both had enough gas, you could just go back and forth with no errors or problems. It would be beautiful. That's one of the main reasons I swap is because of that. It takes three times as long trying to just race people without swapping. There's a 7.1 run. Wait, is it my turn to win? Crap, I don't know. I think I downshifted. I don't, I forget. I hope that was... It must have been, because I actually downshifted, because I, at the last second I thought, oh no, it's this guy's turn to win. It must not have been. Alright. I'm too busy talking and not paying attention to the races, I guess. Three, two, one, go. That was perfect. That would have been a 6.9 run right there. Alright. I'm going to say later. I think that one looks nice. I like the way he's painted his car. Three, two, one, go. That wasn't a bad. That wasn't bad. That's a six point. Six point zero. I mean a seven point zero. I might be wrong on this one. Nope, 7.0. I'm happy with a 7.0 run. 6.9, 7.0, awesome. 7.1, not bad. 7.2 or slower, terrible. Alright, his turn to win. That was perfect, too. That would have been a 6.9 run right there. I went down into the wrong gear. Alright, let's go ahead and win another one. Three more things of gas. So three more races. Two more after this one. Three, two, one, go. All right, that's a 7.0 run. All right, I bet you I got a 7.0. Maybe, maybe a 6.9, but if I did barely 6.9. Yep, 7.0. Have I been wrong on one of these yet? Except for the one where I downshifted on... I did downshift on that one, so that one didn't count, but... I don't think I've been wrong once. Three, two, one, go. That was very, very good. That would have probably been a 6.9 run, I think. Except for I got to let him win. And I got one more, one more race to win. This one's all mine. And I'll get my 10 keys out of this, and then I'm done. Thank you for the swap, Super Burt. That's not super. I told you guys I'm dyslexic, lexic, so. Spurbert or something. 
three, two, one, go. That was a really good run, but that was that was a seven point one. I bet that's seven point one. And give me my keys. Oh, that was a 7.0. Alright, thank you. I'm out of gas, buddy. I'm done for the day. Not for the day, but I'm done for a few hours. So, I appreciate the swaps. And, I guess I'm going to go ahead and end this video. Catch you guys later. See ya.